Good morning. It's Christmas in July. I've got a package that came in the mail today. It's from Patrick Gage from Texas, all the way from Texas. I, before I open it, I want to tell you who Patrick is. He has a channel, a video uh, channel, and it's called Soapy Oaks Farm. And he makes the most wonderful soaps, and I subscribe to him. He subscribes to me, and he had a contest. Uh, he had a drawing, and, and you put... Anyway, there were clues to the drawing, and I can remember one of them. He said you had to use the word winner. I used it three times, but I never in my wildest thought I'd be the winner. And I was. I was. And it came today. And I'm going to open it up, and we'll see what's in it. I know there's his soaps in it, because he showed us a picture of what we'd get. And if these soaps are as half as soothing as his voice is, they'll be wonderful. So here we go. Oh my goodness, it's packed very, very good. So we'll open another bag. Maybe it'll be one of these things where you keep opening bags and boxes till you get... No, it's gonna... Okay. Uh, I want to turn it over again because I think it was probably packed. Ah, okay. Red. Oh, pretty red. One of my favorite colors. I can smell it already. Okay, I'm going to have to turn on a light because, and I'm going to have to get a magnifying glass because I'm, I'm 81. I got to see it. Okay, I'll be right back. Light on, magnifying glass. I'll be back. Okay, here I come. This is even one of my favorite colors. Okay, ginger lemon. Oh, how wonderful. And it's got olive oil, coconut oil, avocado oil, cocoa butter, mango butter, castor oil, uh, French green yellow clay, uh, a couple of other things, and lemon and ginger root essential oil. And even through, oh, isn't it pretty? I hope you can see that. That is pretty. Oh. Okay, well, let's see. Oh, this is another one of my favorite colors. Oh, and there is the naughty frog. Hopped out, all ready to be naughty. You stay there. Behave. I don't want to hear a, a squeak out of you. They don't squeak, do they? Oh. Okay, <laughs> this is, I don't know if you can see it, but it's, it's got goats on it. Goats and oats, oh how cute. Okay, this one is made with, uh, Oat milk, coconut milk, olive oil, avocado oil, shea butter, castor oil, and even some honey. Oh. Okay. And, and I wish you could see it. It's, it's got a, a goat head on the front right there. Oh. Another one of my favorite colors. Love this color blue. Chamomile and rosemary. Oh yes, some of my favorites. Okay, 
It's got goat's milk. The first soap I ever made was goat milk soap, and it was maybe, I don't know how long ago to say. It's got to be, I don't know, 15 years ago or more. Okay, goat milk, coconut oil, olive oil, avocado oil, um, cocoa butter, shea butter, castor oil, rosemary essential oil, and uh, clove? Boy, yeah, clove essential oil, orange essential oil, wintergreen essential oil, chamomile, oh, and calendula petals. How wonderful. Yeah, I can see them on the top there. That is just absolutely wonderful. And you know what? I thought they were going to be little bars. They're not. Okay, this is not one of my favorite colors, but you know, it's an okay color. I can live with that. And, and yes, it's, it's still pretty. It's probably not something I would wear, but I'd wear this one or the other. And it looks pretty with those. So, oh, now we have some salve. Oh, you know what, this one, I've just, I'm going to open, if I can. Well, um, he's got it sealed. Patrick, you sealed it. But before it's over, I want to open it. Okay, maybe, I, maybe I'm not strong enough. Okay, Clay Mountain. Oh, Clay Mountain is very pretty. It looks like it has a leaf pattern on it. Okay, it's goat's milk, coconut oil, olive oil, shea butter, cocoa butter, mango butter, castor oil. Oh, sandalwood. Oh, that's one of my favorite. Neem powder, hibiscus petal, yellow and green French clay, and Brazilian clay. Oh, and oh. It is two-tone. I don't know if you can see that. It's lighter here and it fades, uh, it's darker here and fades into the light. And it has this wonderful leaf pat on, pattern on it type thing. And believe it or not, sandalwood is one of my favorites. Okay. Oh, this is so neat. Well, this one came wrapped in green again. And it is... What's its real name? Natural Impressions. What a big bar. And I can read this one. It's olive oil, coconut oil, avocado oil, cocoa butter, shea butter, castor oil, sandalwood powder, tomato powder, walnut shell powder, indigo powder, matter root. Oh, oh, Patrick, thank you, thank you. It's just more than I ever expected. And it goes on. Chamomile Luxury. Oh, I feel like this is all a luxury. Yes. And it has goat's milk, coconut oil, olive oil, cocoa butter, meadow foam oil. I've never used that. That's the only one so far that I've never used that I've been reading Okay, castor oil, uh, some other things, ground rose hips, cinnamon, turmeric. I love it when they say turmeric, but <laughs> turmeric. Okay, chamomile, oh, and bergamot. Oh, <laughs> there. Whoops. Well, okay. There's more in here. It goes on and on childhood and it has a spinning top oh I wish it oh how cute see it it's just really cute it's just cute as anything and um, goat's milk coconut oil olive oil avocado oil cocoa butter mango butter castor oil oh 
Uh, it just says fragrance. Oh, now, <laughs> what am I going to even use first? This is the most wonderful pro <laughs> thing I've ever won. Coke, okay, this one is called Carbon Heart. Wow. You see the hearts? Is this like a black heart? Okay, coconut oil, sunflower oil, castor oil, shea butter, mango butter, and activated um, charcoal, and so forth. Oh, this is it. This is the, oh, and there's a card, a card has my name on it. Oh, congratulations. Oh, big hugs from Patrick. Well, Patrick, I hug you back. <laughs> it's just, thank you, thank you. I just can't believe this happened to me. Okay, goat mor milk morning. And it has the goat milk, the coconut oil, olive oil, shea butter, cocoa butter, mango butter, castor oil. And uh, isn't that pretty? It's very pretty. And, and you know, I, I used to, in fact, in my other life, <laughs> before we moved here, I was called the goat lady. <laughs> that, that's funny, isn't it? Yeah, I was called the goat lady. They didn't know my name, maybe, but they, they said down there at the goat lady, at the goat's lady. And um, we sold goats, we milked goats, we ate goats, we made soap with <laughs> uh, goat's milk. We made cheese and uh, kefir and even butter. You can make butter with goat's milk. Do you know that? So... Anyway, this is just more than I ever thought, really, Patrick. It is just wonderful. I am so glad I won. And, and let me tell you, I have won. Uh, a long time ago, there was this drawing where you put in your name, and I won something. And this is much better than what I won before, because what I won before... I never really used. What I won before was a chain saw. Tom used it. Our older boys used it. But this I get to use. Tom gets to use. And it's just absolutely wonderful. More than I ever, ever expected. And if you want to see him make some wonderful, wonderful soaps, Go and look at his channel. It's Soapy Oaks Farm, and his name is Patrick Gage. He has this wonderful voice, and he tells you all about soap making. And some of the soaps you think you should say some bad words so you could get your mouth washed out with them. So I, I'm going to just say thank you. Thank you, and I'll keep my eye on this frog because you never know what he... I wonder if it's a girl frog. I can't tell. But what that frog might do. And so this is a very wonderful way to start my week and my day. Oh, thank you. And all of you have a good day. And look at I'm going to be such a clean person. So goodbye now.